Hey, I got some Toronto gameplay stored on my hard drive, and I need something to go on top of that. The Leafs made two trades today. The first one was made just like 20 minutes before I woke up in the morning, and as a result, I was like, eh, I'm not gonna talk about it, because it was a pretty minor deal where the Toronto Maple Leafs were able to acquire Dennis Malgin from the Florida Panthers. It was in exchange for a player that the Leafs called up for a little bit in Mason Marchment, and this was a trade that a lot of people were like, kind of confused about because, hey, these two teams are division rivals, why the heck are they helping each other out? But this to me is just a small, small little move where either team sees a little bit more value in the other player than the other teams that they originally come from. Marchmand is a guy who barely was able to crack the NHL roster. He was pretty good with the Marlies, but he just only played a very few amount of games with the Maple Leafs, so going over to Florida, he might get a little bit of an extended role, most likely. And as for Maljan, he's a guy who did indeed play with Austin Matthews with the Zurich Lions back in 2015-2016, so that is a pretty interesting little connection that they have over there. He was pretty good with the Lions, 17 points in 38 games back then. He was, of course, only 19 years old, now he's 23. So we'll see if he'll be able to break into this Toronto lineup and actually do some damage. He'll be given an opportunity and we'll see about that. On to the next trade that the Toronto Maple Leafs did, it's a trade with the Ottawa Senators. Aaron Luchuk and a conditional 6th round pick has been traded to the Ottawa Senators in exchange for Max Verano. Now this is an interesting one, because Aaron Luchuk is technically an ECHLer, but he's a really good ECHLer. 49 points in 44 games for the 22-year-old center. He's a guy who didn't get that much AHL time, and he's been tearing up the ECHL, so that's where the majority of his value is. Throw in the conditional 6th round pick, and the Ottawa Senators send over a Max Verono. A guy who's 6 foot 1, 194 pounds as a right winger, 24 years old, he just wrapped up 4 years at Princeton University as one of their better players. I was always keeping my eye on Princeton University because they did indeed also have a few notable free agents in the college side of things. In particular, I'm talking about Josh Tevez, a guy that the Canucks were able to sign as well. But Verono came over into the Ottawa Senators organization at the end of last season, got 4 points in 12 games. Now he's spent the majority of his time with the Belleville Senators in the AHL and hasn't been as good as people thought he would be. Who knows, maybe coming over to Toronto will give him an extended look and a new opportunity here. And whether that's with the Marlies or with the Maple Leafs, I'm expecting some pretty big things out of Verono. I wouldn't be surprised if this guy was able to become a bottom six NHLer one day who could put up a pretty good amount of points. We talked about this a few videos like a year ago talking about Verono, but the guy got 55 points in 36 games with Princeton as a junior before coming over and ending off his college career with 37 points in 31 games as an alternate captain, he's had a pretty good NCAA resume, and that's why he was one of the more acquirable free agents in the NCAA class last year. And now, after a trade which sends Lutruk and a conditional sixth over to Ottawa, he is a Toronto Maple Leaf. So the Leafs have legitimately added two borderline tweener NHL players. Maljin is probably the much more NHL-ready player than Verano, but Verano to me is a player who could probably be playing in the NHL today. It's just a matter of the role, the ice time, all that stuff. But Toronto's made two trades today. We'll see where they go with their extended look towards the trade deadline. It's crazy the amount of trades that are going on, and the trade deadline isn't today. Hope you enjoyed this video. And... Bye.